Hey guys, it's Kristen with another Chance Resale. Welcome to my channel. I'm a full-time reseller. And in this video, I have a thread up mixed jewelry rescue box that I will be opening. But first, I always like to have um, a little introduction, if I can, of a little special treat for you guys. So today on today's agenda, we have a little bit of a sterling sale. So, um, Without further ado, I'm just going to get on into it. If you are interested in anything, you have to email me at anotherchanceresale1 at gmail.com. Everything is always in my description box, all the information you need. Um, please email me with the timestamp and or screenshot of the item or items you would like. And I do ship international. And let's just hop on in. You guys are feel free to ask me any questions you have. Um... Other than that, like shipping, whatever, $5 under one pound, flat fee. First item we have here, sterling silver, looks like Jack's earrings. Um, I, I don't think these are actual stones. I'm really not sure. I did try to test them with the gem tester, and some of them go up to the quartz line and some don't. So I'm really not sure. To me, they don't feel like stones, so I'm not gonna sell them as such. I'm just gonna sell them as sterling silver, but I did test everything for sterling and they are positive. So we have the first item are the Jack's earrings. And I, I don't think I saw a mark on them, but they are sterling. And these are going to be $12. Then we have these sterling earrings, which I didn't see a mark either, but I did test them and they did test for sterling. They have the pave crystals on the front and plain on the back. And these will be 10. We have these earrings, like retro, almost mod also, <laughs> does that even make sense? These I believe are hollow, they're not um, solid sterling, but these will be 12. Um, let's do a ring, so we have this ring it's kind of a wider band. It has turquoise and coral chips. And let's see, it's not marked either, but it does test sterling. I tested everything. This is size five. And we'll do 12 on that one. Uh, let's do this. We have an inklet, sterling silver, with the little butterfly and the blue enamel, and there's another little butterfly up here. Awesome, very cute. So you can adjust it to this length or probably that length, I'm pretty sure. I did try this on as a bracelet. It's very large, so I believe it to be, <laughs> I believe it to be an anklet. It is marked there, 925. Um, 925NV. This will be 12. Perfect for the warm weather coming. Break out those ankles. <laughs> okay, so now let's do a pendant. I do not have a sterling chain for this unless I'd put one on it, unfortunately. And I think this is just a cabochon. I don't think this is onyx or anything, but this is sterling silver marked right there and down there actually, M925. And this is 12. You can kind of get size reference. I don't really have anything to, well, here's a ring. It's a pretty large pendant. That's 12. We have these super cute tiger eye earrings. I put them on here. Well, they came on here, 
um, cause me trying to hold them with my nails is not going to happen. So these are sterling silver studs. These are perfect for me. I love these. Um, tiger eye sterling silver studs. We'll do 12 on those. Speaking of studs, we have these. This is a set of sterling silver and cubic zirconia studs, um, clear and red, two sizes. This is the size I like. These are a little bit bigger. So these are going to be 12. Okay, let's do another ring. These are too small unless I'd be keeping them. This is sterling silver, mother of pearl, onyx, and I don't know the rest. <laughs> I don't know what it could be. Coral or carnelian, and I don't know what the green would be. Green onyx. But it is not marked, but tested. And this is a two and three quarters. And this one is 12. Last ring is this butte. Put it on this way. Um, it kind of looks like a Thunderbird. I'm not exactly sure if that's what it's supposed to be, but it looks that way to me. Coral and turquoise chips. This one is so very cool. Um, it is a little bent. Let me see if I can... Sometimes if you push down on the mandrel, it can straighten it out for you. Yeah, that did a pretty good job. This one is unmarked, except it has something there so I don't really know what that is but I will do 12 on this one as well and it's a size 6 next we have two more items and then we can get on into the thread up box they are necklaces Sterling silver chain, and this is a little, it looks like a bag of money, but it's a, it's a gem, <laughs> a bag of jewels. This is just glass. I did test it with the gem tester. It has the open back, so the light will shine beautifully through. Beautiful, like aquamarine. No, I would say blue topaz, probably. Aqua, aquamarine is more of like a teal, I would I would say but this one is going to be 15. The mark is right there in the link. Pretty short um, chain, probably sits a little past the collar. And then lastly, we have this, which I believe to be is cubic zirconia. Sterling silver. and the sterling silver box chain. And I'm sorry, the last video I had my lamp in the, in the frame the whole time. I try so hard not to do that. I don't know how it always ends up there. And I watch the playback because I edit or whatever. And I'm like, really? <laughs> so my bad. And it says 925 there, Italy. And this one is 18. Okay. Okay. So let's get on into the thread up box. And um, like mentioned in the last one, I did purchase three and they all came from Mechanicsburg PA. So remember, in case you weren't, in case you missed it in the beginning of the video, you have to email me at anotherchanceresale1 at gmail.com with the screenshot and or timestamp. Here's my receipt, $48. The price has gone up from 44. Oh, they rubber banded this one. I love all these, all this bubble um, pillow, bu pillow, air pillows, whatever. 
love reusing that stuff. Okay, so we have a big box. Ooh la la. Let's just save that for last. How about that? <laughs> okay. Ooh, I'm excited. I actually really like these boxes. They're probably my favorite. Okay, so this I can see already is Sea Wonder, which is that tag right there. This is a really cool silver and gold spike cuff. It is a smaller size. Oh, you guys, that is so cool. It fits me perfectly. So it's not going to fall to the front too easily. I love it. Okay, <laughs> um, let's do 12 on it. It's in really, really good condition. A couple minor scratches, but nothing major. That is awesome. Good start to the box. Looks like we have another possible native piece. If you guys missed my last unboxing yesterday of the thread up, I unboxed, actually I have it right here this native piece woo woo okay so let's see yep so this looks like onyx this is beautiful it is marked sterling with a c down there this is beautiful it is a teensy bit big on me You can probably squeeze it, but I'm not going to do that. Yeah, I couldn't wear this. It flops around too much. You know what? I always forget to take my measurement, my measuring tape in here. Hold on. Because I don't think I need it, but I think I do now. So let's go back to the Sea Wonder. And this is... A two and a quarter and I also need to get that bracelet mandrel too so I don't have to keep doing this and six inch around the wrist this one is two and a half and about six and a half around yeah about six and a half around the wrist so let's do 18 on this one this is a really nice native piece all right I can see this is Alex and Ani but I've never seen a black one that's pretty cool with this druzy like that that is really cool You guys see that okay? That is so, and it's in excellent condition. So if anyone's interested in this, let's do, well, let's just do five. Okay, let's look at this first. I went to Savers today, you guys. I found awesome purses. I don't know what my luck is lately about purses. I found Coach and I found Dooney and Burke. Ooh wee, you guys are gonna love the purse sale coming. All right, what is this? This looks like Swarovski. It is Swarovski. Yay! But we're missing all the stones in the swan. But... Uh, let me see. Oh, we're missing stones, guys. We're missing stones. All right, so this part, yeah, there's missing stones. Is it, or are they just dead? Nope, they're missing. So there's a missing one here, and two down here. But if you wear it this way... <laughs> 
There's no stones on that side, and the key is fine. Ugh. Yeah, all right, so um, I'll just do like eight bucks on this if somebody wants it, because it's still really nice. But, all right, I'll, and you know I have to say it. I have to, I'm gonna put my link to my Touchstone Crystal by Swarovski jewelry link in the description box. You guys can take a look at that jewelry, maybe uh, spoil yourself. Uh, what are these? So the, <laughs> these are earrings. What is this? A secret note. So it's a receipt from New York, New York. Not too far from me, ladies and gentlemen. One oak safety pin earrings. But it doesn't say... Oh, it's a gift receipt, that's why. So it's not going to say how much it was. When did they buy these? 2018. Wow. Okay, so they're sterling silver safety pin earrings. I mean, they're pretty cute. Um... I don't know, we'll do 10 on them. An original box with the original receipt. That's pretty cool. Okay. Here we go. We have these. <laughs> what? These are random. These are vintage, I would think. Gold tone and enamel. Purple and pink. Little hoops. Little half hoops. Just trying to look for any markings. I don't see any. Looking on the posts. No. Um, I don't know. We can just do five in them. Kind of cool. We got some stunner studs. Stunner studs. Um, hmm, okay. Let's take a little peeky at you. I do not see any markings. Hmm. Hmm. Let's see. Are you sterling? I don't know how it, uh, <laughs> to. No, tis not. So, okay, these are just fashion earrings. Not sterling, but they're still pretty. They're big. They're very big. So we can do five on those. I see some new bobble bar. Okay, this actually helps because I've definitely gotten these earrings a few times in different colors in Goodwill blue boxes. I've got them in this color and in like that pinkish color. So now I know that they're bobble bar. I figured they were Sugar Fix, which is the same company. So brand new on the card. These earrings are crazy. Um, wow, my my lighting looks pretty uh pretty good, huh? Almost too good. What's going on? It looks weird, doesn't it? That was weird. Okay, so <laughs> sorry. Uh, let's do eight on these. These are cool. Ooh, these are pretty. Ooh, I like these. Celebrity. Don't think I've heard of that brand. I feel like I have, but maybe not. Let's see. Celeb. Ready. 
earrings. <laughs> uh, celebrity brand. I don't know, guys. Vintage celebrity brand of New York, celebrity here. All right, so they, they're they ranging all over the place. I think these are also them too, brand celebrity. All right, so that's fine. I mean, these are really cool. Let's do 12 on them. I like these. We have a bangle and it's J. Crew. I thought it'd be either J. Crew or Kate Spade. So there's J. Crew right there. And it's um is it black? I think it's like a I think it's blue. And all the stones are there. Little push. Very nice. So we can do, uh, let's do six on this one. And now I can't get it off. There we go. Six dollars. We have a ring. La la la. It's blue. Okay, I have to turn Pressy back on. So it has that little um, sizer in there. But is she silver? Possibly. Is it a she or a he? A she or a he? A she. Well, let's test her out. No, tis not sterling. Which I doubt these are going to be real stones then. Nope doesn't even oh yeah it kind of moves it so they're probably glass which is fine it's pretty it's pretty let's get you a size a little sizey size so right now it sits at a five but it can go to about a six and a half And let's just do, let's just do five on it. Ooh, yay, another ring. Ooh, yay, another ring. Oh, you guys, this one is so pretty. Hold on, I'm looking at it first. <gasps> oh, see, I would keep it if it fit my middle finger. I know you guys are like, let me see it. I love it. But I don't want to wear, I don't want a ring finger ring. Something like this I would want to wear on my middle finger. And it's, yeah, it can probably squeeze, but I ain't doing it. Let me just see. Ooh, yeah. That looks like it's quartz. Pink quartz. Here, I'll show you. <laughs> So, okay, okay, girl. I see you. Let's give her a little test. No, tis not. Well, she's not marked, so. Oh, I, for I just remembered, because I'm looking out the window, and the neighbor across the street is getting out of her car with um, you know, like the black bag from the liquor store. And it just reminded me, I left my high noons in the car. I, I went and got, have you guys ever had high noon? Oh my God. Oh my God. It's so good. I am not a truly fan. I am not a white claw fan. Blech, I do not like seltzer, but high noon is made with soda and vodka. And the flavor is like natural flavor. 
and my favorite is peach and then pineapple and then grapefruit. I don't like the watermelon and I don't really like the black cherry, but they are so good. You guys should try them. Okay, that was my um, <laughs> adult beverage talk. Let's do uh, let's do 12 on it. I'm feeling nice. I feel like giving you guys an extra good price because I'd probably list that for 20 or more dollars. Okay, this one. Ooh, that's pretty. So we got a green stone in the center. Clear around the edges. Or, well, around the one edge. Oh, it's cremins. Okay. Cremins. Oops, I just dropped my measuring tape. Uh, right there, you can see it. I don't think they did precious metals, did they? Let's see. Oh. <laughs> that would be a negatory. Or that would be a dub. And the needle is not moving here. Okay. So that's fine. It's just gold tone, but it's still cute. If anyone is Irish, like St. Patty's Day with the green, if your birthstone is green, this is for you. If you want to give it to your mom or you know, your aunt or somebody, this is awesome. So let's do, we can do 10 on that. Very pretty, very dainty and cute. Okay, so we have two more things. We have this, one more, and then the big box. Ooh, this is cool. This is just a fashion piece, it's no name, but look at, hold on, look at that. I feel like an Egyptian princess wearing this necklace. It does have, actually no, it doesn't. I was gonna say a slight wear, but no, that really doesn't. It's pretty good, it looks pretty good. So we can just do five on that. That is really pretty. Okay, let's see. This looks like J. Crew. Tiz, tiz. Look right there. So this is really neat. This is red with square um, rondelles. I almost said Rivoli's. Very cool. And there's your signature J. Crew information. We can do eight on that. Actually, let's do six. Let's do six dollars. All right. I built this up. Better be something good in here. <laughs> oh, I'm nervous. See, why is my screen doing that again? I'm nervous. I'm nervous. Ready, set. <gasps> oh, okay. Okay. Well, you look vintage, maybe. Nope, it's not. But it appears it gives that vibe. Okay, so we have the earrings. They're studs, but they do have a little dangle. Oh, God, I would feel like Miss Scarlet wearing this from Clue. With, like, a beautiful black dress or just a black top. That's pretty nice. It is just a modern fashion piece, but it is in excellent condition. It comes with the earrings. And I mean, it, it's absolutely beautiful. I love the red, the enamel. Yeah, so um, we'll do, oh God, I don't know. We'll do $12 on the set. How about that? And these are my discounted subscriber prices that only you guys get because it's a thank you for your support and your your just friendship and love and care that you guys just give to me and show me and just spend some time with me. And this is how I say thank you. 
And anything that doesn't get sold through YouTube, I list on eBay for like double. So this is just my little way of saying thank you for all your support. I have to just reiterate that every so often because I do get new um, subscribers. Welcome, by the way, if you're new. And if you haven't subscribed, what are you waiting for? Click that subscribe. It's free. You can also click the thumbs up because that helps my channel grow in the algorithm. And press the bell so you're notified the next time I make another video, which is usually every day. <laughs> Sometimes I take breaks on the weekends, but if I have a lot of inventory to go through, I'll, I'll, you know, I'll push through. Okay, guys, so that's everything. So let's see. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve. 13, 14, 15, 16. Okay, so it says 15. Sometimes I've gotten 14 before. Sometimes I've gotten 16. So either way, I'm very happy. And remember to email me at anotherchanceresale1 at gmail.com. Everything's always in my description box. Thank you guys so, so much for watching and spending your time with me. And we will see you in the next one.